What's going on, headbangers? Welcome back to the channel. I hope you're having a killer day. Thanks for tuning in like always. If you're new to this channel, I'm Gorkor, and today we're gonna check out some new Metalocalypse. Now, if you're not familiar with this band or the TV show that used to be on Adult Swim, I suggest you check that out. You might not get a kick out of this if you're not familiar with the characters and what they're all about. However, if you are, then you probably realize that they've put out new music. So we're gonna check out the track Aortic Desecration. This is from the upcoming album, The Death Album 4, which is due out on August 22nd. I'm looking forward to checking this out. Hopefully it's fun. I definitely enjoyed the show well enough. Let's get into it. True story. I didn't actually realize this was a lyric video, so I thought we were gonna get the characters in the video. My apologies. Still cool to check the song out though. Very spacey sort of rip, I like it, it's cool, a little bit different. And there we have it. That was Aortic Desecration. I definitely enjoyed this well enough, but I must admit that I'm a little disappointed that we didn't have some footage with the actual characters from the show because that's what really brings this project to life. 
I should have educated myself before going into this, including that it was a lyric video. I mean, it's right in the title, Corey, get with the program. But I overlooked that, just thought that we would get them in this video, but we didn't. So it was simply just an image with lyrics on the screen. So nothing too exciting there. But as far as the music goes, it was very well done. All the musicians are doing a great job here. There's some catchy parts in this. I enjoyed the synth in the background. Now, I am curious, though, does Brendan Small actually do these guttural vocals or does he use an effect? I don't care either way, but I did see some live footage and it really didn't sound that good to me. His vocals weren't guttural at all. It sounded quite different, which makes me think that he probably uses an effect. And given that the quality of Nathan Explosion's voice, I just think that that's using an effect to achieve that. Just curious, don't care either way. The song was still good, definitely fun. Like I said, I wish the characters had been in there to bring some life to it, but nonetheless, it's well put together. I'm also curious, is Gene Hoagland still involved with this on drums, or is he a thing of the past? I'm not really too sure. Again, I'm not up to speed on this. And I do believe that they are releasing either a new movie or have just released a new movie, and I think that's to tie things up because the show got cancelled. Again, not 100% sure. If you know, please let me know down below. Always happy to be educated about music. I definitely enjoyed the show well enough. It's simple, stupid humor that metalheads can enjoy, and there's a lot of inside references if you're part of the scene. So, if you haven't checked it out, I definitely recommend doing that. If you're familiar with this and enjoy it, keep supporting them. If you're not, check out the music. Support it like any band that you enjoy. Now, if you have a moment to support this channel, then please subscribe. It helps the channel grow. We would definitely appreciate it. If you like this video, impale the like button if you'd like to get our future updates and stab the notification bell down below for that as well as you can check out the socials down below you can follow me on instagram there's a spotify playlist there for songs i've done reactions to as well as if you'd like to check out my band then click on mr grind studios down below and check out cephalectomy we just put out a brand new song i'd be happy to have you check that out give me some feedback thanks so much for tuning in for another reaction i hope you have a killer day cheers everybody stay sick